now comes the age range of 18 to 22, okay? 18 to 22. So now we are age 18 to 22. Let's, let's see what, what the loser is up to, okay? Age 18 to 22, first things first, one of the great American enslavement tools, okay? We don't need a plantation anymore. We're all on the plantation, okay? And that is D E B T debt. Right as soon as you turn 18, a lot of guys that have poorly that you know it's it's you see loserdom is passed on from family and, and ge it's a generational curse right when you see a bunch of fucking obese people a, a big fat family they're passing on their disease you see a bunch of poor people they're passing on their disease of poverty okay and at age 18 all right this right here is something that targets a lot of people Debt, credit card companies start hitting you up. I know I took this. I I took this bait. I took this bait with a the quickness. They're like, "Hey, do you want a five hundred dollar credit card?" It's like, "Yeah." They're like it's eighteen percent APR. I was like, "What the hell does that mean?" Just give me the free five hundred bucks. Maxed it out in like a month. Don't have money to pay it back. Now, guess what? Credit score. Right? Credit goes down. Right? You have to pay interest. And guess what? Interest is constantly going up. It stacks against you. All right? This is credit card debt. Target the, They target you guys. They engineer, they engineer campaigns specifically to target young people. They psychologically manipulate their marketing in order to maximize the probability of these young, unsuspecting people to get into debt. And then they tell you, debt is good. You need debt to build your life up, right? It's almost as dumb as dumb fucking morons like Janet Yellen, her saying, yeah, inflation is good. We need inflation. <sighs> okay. Ben Jones, you think I don't have that covered, man? Come on now. Next one is, you know, why get him for 500? Right? 500 to, I know people have gotten up to like, you know, $50,000 in credit card debt. Okay. This is negative. Can you imagine that? This is just age 18 to 22. Now, you have a negative $50,000 hole you got to dig yourself out of. Artemis Cameron's in the house. One of our top moderators says... Stopping 18-year-old kids from buying GameStop shares, but if they want to sign up for $100,000 of student loan debt or a high-interest credit card, no problemo. That's right, because they are a good, willing, slave sheep. That's what they want, okay? That is what they want. Next thing is, College. College debt. They did not take their education seriously in high school, so they don't have a good GPA. Therefore, they were not able to qualify for scholarships to get a free education. And now, guess what? College debt. All right? Now you're looking at a minimum of $60,000 in debt by the time you get out of college with today's prices. Minimum. Minimum, guys. Minimum.
Okay. To top it off, <laughs> to top it off, sixty thousand dollars in debt, and you get a degree in business administration. <laughs> what the fuck is this? What in the proper, absolute fuck is business administration? Can somebody please break this down for me? Okay. I'm going to make fun of myself here for a moment. You can also get your BS in psychology. <laughs> That's what I got. I got my bachelor's in science and psychology. But I went for the education of the psychology. I had a plan. And my four-year degree was acquired to get me into Japan. But enough about me. I'm really not important. Let's actually delete that. That was my ego trying to compensate. Like, hey, guys, I'm not a loser. I swear. Excuse me. Sorry. I've been slamming Coke Zero. <clears throat> um, okay. Now you choose these useless degrees. All right. And this right here is age 18 to 22. And that, that right there. That's just talking about the money. <laughs> That's just the money. 